What up guys, J Flesh Tanks. Been gone a while, but I've been super busy. Um, not only with personal life and work, but uh, tanks. You are, uh, as you can see, this is, this is a new setup right here. African cichlids, and I know they'll need a bigger tank. If I like them enough, they'll get a bigger tank. You know how I do things, guys. That's just the way it is for now. They're going to chill in this tank. There's 12 of them in there. I don't know all the names, but I'm just starting to learn all that stuff, so I'm not going to just uh, throw out names. But once I know them all, I'll definitely let you know. Some peacocks in there. Uh, that guy's an asshole, right? It's a little cloudy, just did a water change. But uh, there it is, man. 56 African cichlid tank. I was going to do it as a reef, but uh, I don't know, man. I I figured I got a 36 reef, and then I'm working on a 20 long upstairs right now in my kid's room. So why not try something else? So said, uh african cichlids man step back a little bit i couldn't find the tripod so it is what it is sorry for the uh shakiness but i, I like it man i i was thinking about doing some plants like uh you know java fern and nubius things like that but i don't think i'm going to i think i'm just going to leave it straight rockscape and they they seem to be digging it man they're all eating well. There's not like a real, real, real bad aggression. There's definitely a pecking order, but nothing, uh, nothing major. That dude seems to be kind of the king, as you can see him chasing people around. But it hasn't been, it hasn't been anything real bad. But uh, wanted to, uh, wanted to show that tank off. A little bit and uh, we'll go take a look at the 40 because want to give a real quick update on that tank and talk about the FERTs from uh, CCAM. I know Mr. Honey to use running that contest for those uh, the the Aqua Vitro FERTs so I'm gonna kind of give you guys a review on those things are uh, needless to say they're pretty badass so let me uh, let me clip over to that tank and we'll show you that and uh, Let's do that real quick. Alright guys, here's the 40 long. I mean, it's it's got good, good growth. And uh, Aqua Vitro is what I'm dosing in this tank, and I'm just seeing a complete difference in, in plant growth. Um, I'm using um, the nitrogen, the iron, and the vitamin supplement, which I mean, there's a, there's three more bottles that I'll probably go pick up that are different supplements. Like, oh God, I can't remember the name of them all. It's all new, but real, real, real happy with those guys. As you can see, I mean, this stuff, the camera's really not picking it up. I mean, pearl weed's nice and green. You can see this. This is just, this, this little wiggy is just absolutely beautiful. And then I just clip some off and put some down there, so all that's going to be nice and red next to this bush of pearl weed. I keep saying I'm going to trim it, but I don't know. I'm liking it. All the uh, all the uh, Green Temple High Grow got trimmed. And if you look at this Rotala, it's just got a different look to it now. Just like, I mean, this came out of a different tank right there I don't know if you can kind of tell the difference but look at the difference of that so great furts just wonderful furts really impressed with those and uh, the fish room is coming guys I'm telling you I've been busting my hump down there trying to get things going uh, I will uh, next video I'll do a nine tank update so <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll sh I'll show you all nine tanks that are gonna be up right now there's 
40 long is obviously up, the 56 African cichlid tank that you just saw, the 36 reef is up, 20 gallon cherry shrimp tank is up, 20 long is cycling reef tank, um, 29 gallon in the downstairs is up, growing plants, 40 breeder is hardscaped, 10 gallon is getting ready to breed some cherry shrimp, uh, bare bottom, fluval flora is broken down, and uh, be picking up a couple more 10 gallons for uh, some bee shrimp and uh, some probably probably some cherry, sh yeah, probably some. I'll probably do crystals, but there's a uh, there's a local breeder around here that does uh, a couple a couple shrimp that I can't get at the local fish store. So if I purchase, I don't want to say what they are because I, I can't guarantee I'm going to get them, but it's it's looking like they might be getting purchased and I honestly I haven't seen anybody on YouTube one of them I've yet to see on YouTube so hopefully that's coming man that's coming so appreciate uh, everybody hanging in there while I'm uh, trying to get all my 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 personal tanks and up in order and get going the way I want them and uh, you know I haven't been online, I haven't been on the website, fireduptfishtanks.ning.com, but I will be. You know, you know I'm always fired up. I'm just uh, super busy, man. Maintenance and trying to get everything going. And uh, got some new fish in 36 Reef, which I'll save that for in the next video. The next video, I'm just going to warn you, is going to be long because it's going to be update, update, showing tanks. Um, so real real giddy about that like I said downstairs has got a 29 a 10 and a 40 breeder set up fluval flora is down there but it's broken down and a couple more 10 gallons are coming so long update two tanks there's the uh, planted and uh, African cichlids um, if I like them they'll get a bigger tank and so far I'm, uh, I'm actually really liking them so J Flesh Tanks, Mr. Mom Tanks, fired up fishtanks.ning.com.